We're down to the last two. We've got one more sheet still in the developer. And the nice advantage of this is we're in the light most of the time. So the only time we're in the dark is when we're loading the film to start and then when we switch the, to the cap that has a developer in it. And everything else can be done in room light, I say incandescent, uh, small incandescent bulb, under safe light if you get nervous, but these films, I've even done 400 speed film and I've never had a problem. So again, we're gonna do about 10 seconds in the stop bath and then we're gonna take all the film out. And the film is not gonna be pretty because it hasn't been fixed yet. And it's easy if you just grab it in here and then gently just pull it out. As you can see, it's got a little bit of anti-halation back still on the back, so we'll put it in the fixer to get rid of that. And since this is T-Max film, I'd recommend fixing for twice as long. So we'll take each of the films out, and again, you just sort of, that's why I like it near the edge, so you can grab it, gently pull it in, and gently pull it out. And I say, you can see the anti-halation back is still on there from the parts that touch the inside of the tube. We started working with hangers a lot rather than trays when we did the workshops because less of a chance of scratching the film because this, the, the hangers can be done in the light and it's just easier to do the fixing. We can do the washing in this one. So I'm just going to take all these out. And again, you can see the little anti-halation backing still on there. Got two more to go. And I say it's pretty easy to take them out, even with gloves on. But as I say, it's, it's very nice working in the light. And you can see more anti-halation on the back here. And the ones that are already in here, you can already see the anti-halation back is gone. So I'm going to leave these in the fixer for about 10 minutes. And what I would do is about every minute, about every half a minute, just agitate them a little bit. And you can see it's starting to get very clear, the first one, but the pink is still there. So as I say, we'll leave them in for a little while, at least 8 to 10 minutes. And it's not like paper where you have to worry about it soaking in the fixer, soaking in. So I'm going to reset the timer for 10 minutes, and we'll be back in a little bit. We've just finished about 10 minutes in the fixer, and as you can see, the film is cleared, all the pink is gone, so I'd recommend people with T-Max to just double the fixing time. I'm just gonna put it in a wash, and I'd recommend letting it run for about a minute, dump it out, letting it run again, or just putting a hose, something simple like that would be the best way to wash it. So I wanna thank Dimitri for playing music while I was spinning the tubes. And uh, thank Kenny at Manny's Coffee Shop for loaning me the apron so I don't get water all over myself. And I hope this demo was useful for you. Thank you.